There's been significant odds movement for the college football national championship after Texas beat Bama in Tuscaloosa. Look, before the game, Alabama had the second highest odds at plus 600, slightly down from where they opened at plus 700. But after that loss, their odds are now the ninth highest at plus 3,300. Meanwhile, Texas had the ninth highest odds before the game at plus 2,500, but now they are fourth highest at plus 1,100. Nick, in regards to winning the national championship, would you rather buy high on Texas or buy low on Alabama? I think I'd rather buy low on Bama. I think, you know, the concerns about the quarterback are legitimate. I think that's, you know, but I will have to give Nick Saban, you know, this is the best coach of all time. He's going to be able to figure that out. I think you can look at the SEC. This is not the same SEC we've seen in years past. We've seen Florida lose. We've seen LSU lose. I think, you know, Alabama is going to figure this out. If they come through the SEC unscathed, they're going to get into the CFP even with one loss early in the season. And I think, you know, at 34 to 1, that's some pretty juicy odds for the level of talent that they have and for Nick Saban's track record. So I think I'd stay away from Texas. They're, they're a legitimate team. Quinn Ewers is legitimate. This is not me fading Texas in any way. I think purely from a value perspective, 34 to 1 on Alabama, that seems pretty juicy. And I'd be pretty interested in that. Great stuff, Nick. And don't forget, you can catch Inside the Lines every Friday, 11 a.m. Eastern on BetMGM YouTube channel.